the face-off. It's the dominant Soviets team versus the Miracle on Ice, the U.S. What a game here we have today. The young, inexperienced American team doing their best to fend off the highly, highly rated Soviets in the 1980 Olympic Finals. And here's Callahan. Got the ball, got the puck. It's a goal, U.S. goal. The 1982 World Cup in Spain. This is Italy versus West Germany. Italy has possession of the ball right now. It's looking very good, very good. And here's the kick. It's a goal! It's a goal! Italy has scored the first goal. Back at it. This is the 1982 World Cup in Spain. Italy again with the possession of the ball. Here's a strike. It's a save. What a save. Oh, and he butchers Back it Back at out. it with the World Cup. Italy has the advantage. It's 2-1. Back in Italy's possession. Here we are. Here's the kick. It's a goal. Goal. Italy has the upper hand. 3-1. Wow. Here comes the FIFA president with the World Cup trophy, handing it to the Italian captain and man of the match. Yes! <laughs> So good evening, everyone. Welcome back to the National College Championship. As you can see here tonight, this is the last play of the night. We have Doug Flutie here. He's about to throw a Hail Mary. Here he goes. And it's caught. He has won the College National Championship for the Boston Eagles. Good evening, everyone. Welcome back to NBC News. We are just getting some reports now that we have a assassination attempt on Ronald Reagan. Everything's under control at the White House. There's no problems. There are just heavy security going on right now, down, as you can see, when I play the video. <laughs> it didn't make much sense, Henry. He puts you here and then he runs around where he comes. Obi-Wan never told you what happened to your father. He told me enough! He told me you killed him. No. I am your father. No. No. That's not true. That's impossible! Search your feelings. You know it to be true. Good evening, everyone. Welcome back to NBC News. We are live in Cape Canaveral, Florida, where recently today the Challenger mission exploded seconds upon its flight. Unfortunately, all Challenger members have been confirmed dead. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. We have main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1. And liftoff, liftoff of the 25th Space Shuttle mission, and it has cleared the tower.
throttle down to uh, 65 percent shortly. Engines at 65 percent, three engines uh, running normally, three good fuel cells, three good APUs. Velocity 2,257 feet per second. Altitude 4.3 nautical miles, downrange distance 3 nautical miles. So the 25th Space Shuttle mission is now on the way after more delays than NASA cares to count. This morning it looked as though they were not going to be able to get off. One minute, 15 seconds. Velocity, 2,900 feet per second. Altitude, 9 nautical miles. Downrange distance, 7 nautical miles. Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome back to NBC News. We are getting another report tonight that we are seeing some ex explosion problems. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. This is live from NBC News. We are reporting from uh, Cape Canaveral, Florida, where recently there was a Challenger. <laughs> this is good to get some bloopers in there. Let's just put some bloopers in there so we have a good day. And here's Italy with the kick. <laughs> and here's Doug Flutie with the final throw in the National uh, Football Championships. Oh my god! You oh, my hand. Okay, Italy has a possession of the ball. Oh, um, I don't know what's going on here. It appears there's a stoppage in the play. It's a goal! Wait, wait, um, it, red card? I'm not sure. It looks like the ref may give a red card. Uh, I'm not, uh, wow. Don't know what's going on here. Oh, the goal! 